All right, here we go, guys. The Christmas celebration on Global is officially upon us. So let's jump into the news here and see what they have in store for us. Starting with the campaign details, it says, Full of Wonders Merry Christmas Campaign Part 1 begins. So it is at least going to be a two-part celebration as we predicted. And I'm thinking that Part 2 will be bringing with it LR Kale and Khalifla, as well as the AGL Super Saiyan Blue Kao Ken Goku's Extreme Z Awakening now. I can't confirm that, but I think there's a good chance. But let's see what part one has in store. So it says, come obtain a new wallpaper via the login bonus. You can also get tons of dragon stones through the special missions and the legendary challenge campaign. So uh, I actually didn't know we had a new wallpaper, so let's check this out. Okay, so we got the new Santa Roshi, which is basically the same thing as... Uh, oh, I can't click it. Okay, so same thing as the um, Roshi... Oh, wait, did I say Santa Roshi? Uh, this is Santa Goku, but this is the same thing as the Santa Roshi as well as the Santa Trunks and Maya, essentially just an Elder Kai, but I would recommend that you don't spend this because um, they're pretty hard to get. So definitely lock this Goku and just keep it for collection purposes. I mean, that's at least what I'm going to do. So let's see what this uh, wallpaper looks like, guys. Um, menu and wallpaper settings. Oh, that looks pretty nice. Okay, here we go. Um, I mean, I, I, I like the theme, I, I like the idea, but I don't know if I necessarily dig the quality of the image. I feel like it's a little bit low res. It's okay. Back to the news here, and let's move on to, let's see. Uh, in addition, new SSR Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku Kaioken, will make his debut in the international version Stokon Festival. We knew about that. Meanwhile, don't miss out on various events including a new story event and also the 14th virtual Dokkan Ultimate Clash. And uh, that's it, enjoy the events or join the events and enjoy Dokkan Battle during the Christmas season. Okay, so first things first, we have a login bonus. We're also getting a red Dragonstone, which I just got. If you guys go into your box, you'll find that there as well. And also some special missions, a Dragonstone sale, hopefully it's good. Let's see. It's pretty bad. Okay, <laughs> six dragon stones for 50% off, 32 stones for 50% off, and then 91 stones for 20% off, five times only. So these are some pretty bad sales, guys. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I was expecting more. I really wish they would have given, given us better sales, like another you know 77 stone pack or 100 stone pack with a bonus or something like that. Uh, these sales are very very mediocre from a you know pay to play player's perspective if you guys are free to play it doesn't matter to you but uh this does matter to me especially when it comes to making content making summoning videos so uh yeah that's kind of rough okay moving on uh dokkan festival the goku as well as tech hits return to global finally i mean i think we all saw this coming but if it didn't happen we would have had a riot man because like <laughs> it's been almost a year it's been i think 300 and uh, about 350 days and counting so uh yeah he is finally coming back this banner is dropping literally in uh let's see it's literally dropping in about seven hours from now so put that into your calendars or i don't know put a timer for it or something and uh yeah expect this to drop in very soon okay and next up we have universe survival saga category summon banner stay away from it not worth it um, uh, the Christmas Select Dokkan Festival, so essentially the Red Dragonstone Selection. We can talk about that in just, in just a second. We have a new stage of Beyond God, the Ultimate Secret, which is the new Dokkan stage or Dokkan event stage for the new Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Goku. We have the Universe 6 Story Event, finally on Global, four farmable free-to-play units, some free Dragonstones. Um, Really nice event. I made a video about it going through all the details. So if you guys want to know everything about this event, then go check out that video. And of course, we have the legendary campaign for Int LR Vegeta, also a separate video for that. So go check that out too. Uh, make sure to check the pinned post on that video, by the way, because I did make a mistake in the video talking about the uh, boost categories for the event. I said it was both. Goku's family and uh, Vegeta's family that would boost the drop rates for this event, but I was I was wrong. Obviously, it's only Goku's family for the Vegeta event, and then the Vegeta's uh, Vegeta's family is for the uh, Tech LR Goku's event. All right, so keep that in mind. 
And of course, free stones from that. Free stones from the virtual ultimate clash as well. So that's dropping... Oh, right now. Okay, so we're getting that now too. Well, I mean, not right now, but when the banner drops. So in about, like I said, seven, eight hours or so. And aside from that, we have the return of all of the Universe Survival Saga story events, which is pretty nice. Uh, farmable 17, Farmable 18, and uh, also the Farmable Kaba, I believe. Also, a triple success rate for training. All right. And uh, oh, all hidden potential events are open during the weekends for the next couple of weeks. So some good opportunities to get a lot of orbs that way. Make sure you do it. I think it's worth it. And last but not least, golden weekend missions. So some extra stones on the weekend, some extra sleepy kais on the weekends for some extra missions. Not a bad thing at all. And that's pretty much it, guys. So nothing we didn't necessarily know about already. Um, it's pretty much everything they revealed in the Dokkan Now program, so uh, there you go. That is part one of the Christmas celebration on Global. Part two should be starting in probably like two weeks or so, uh, closer to Christmas. And like I said, I expect LR Kel and Khalifa's banner, and I also expect, if not the Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Goku's Extreme Z Awakening, then at least uh, Tech Golden Frieza, but I really hope it's the Blue Goku, so fingers crossed for that. Um, let's take a quick look at the missions here guys, see how many stones we can expect. So we can get three, ooh, summon tickets, interesting, interesting. Um, so would this be for the Kaioken Goku banner then? Hmm, that'd be interesting, okay. Okay, so here it says, complete all the missions from part one to get up to 16 dragon stones and three Christmas summon ticket. The Christmas summon ticket can be used to summon powerful characters in the Merry Christmas Dokkan Festival. So the Merry Christmas Dokkan Festival must be the Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken... Wait, is it, is it this one? It must be this one, right? I mean, there's no other ban Dokkan Festival banner I can see, so I'm assuming they're talking about this, but I could be wrong. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure the tickets are for the blue Kaioken Goku banner, which is pretty pretty dope. Grab the chance to obtain various missions and obtain rewards, or uh, grab the chance to complete various missions and obtain rewards. So daily missions for one stone each, and then uh, after that it's one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so five stones from the limited missions, and then I guess the remaining 11 stones would be from the dailies. Uh, so that's, I mean... <laughs> Could have been better. It, it, it could have been better. Ho hopefully, part two gives us more stones, because um, that's not the greatest set of missions I've ever seen. Uh, let's go on to the login bonus here, guys. Okay, so today we got the red dragon stone. We got a bunch of candy canes. We got a Santa Roche for Santa Goku, Santa Trunks, and Mai, and then one stone per day until getting closer to Christmas. On Christmas or on Christmas Eve, I guess we get three uh, of the. Uh, dragon stones, three of the dragon stones, three dragon stones, and also three of the summon tickets as well. 26 dragon stones in total from the login bonus, and of course the legendary campaign for Vegeta is on. All the um, details are here that I covered in the video, and also Christmas Select Dokkan Festival. So these are all the units that you can pick with your red dragon stone. Um, if you guys are missing some of these units actually and you already have all the older ones like all these guys already have Then it wouldn't be a terrible idea. I mean here's the thing. They're pretty common right you can get them from every banner so most of you guys should have these but um, I know that some of these guys become really really good after they, they get extreme Z awakenings from that mass extreme Z awakening that JP got so They're not the worst options like the metal cooler especially is like super super good um, but of course, I mean, in Janemba is still like one of the best TURs in the game. Uh, okay, fun fact, I'll worry about that later. Um, of course, AGL Super Saiyan 3 Goku, SDR Gogeta, I mean, I mean, Tech Beerus, they're all good. They're all still really, really good. So if you guys are missing these units, uh, any of them would be pretty much great choices. Like this Kid Buu here is still one of the best support units in the game, right? So moving on, we have, uh, well, I guess that's it for this tab. And then for the events tab, we have the return of the Vegeta Jr. Extreme Z Battle Event, the Goku Jr. Extreme Z Battle Event, the um, Shadow Dragons Story Event comes back from the 4-year anniversary, the uh, Planet Namek um, K 
Kid Gohan event comes back, or his Extreme Z Battle event, and also the Goku, Goku Jr. event comes back as well, of course. So, uh, oh yeah, this is for Vegeta Jr. to farm him and also get his orbs, and then this is for, of course, the Goku Jr. And I guess that's all there is to it, guys. I might keep the... I might keep the wallpaper for like a minute, but um, yeah, I'm not like like a huge fan of it. I, I mean, I don't, I don't dislike it. It's not too bad. So that's gonna do it for today's video, guys. Those are all the details over part one of the Christmas celebration. I would say overall, it's not bad. Um, I do wish that there was more stuff. There were more events to get excited for, but uh, I'm still very excited for this Super Saiyan Blue Kai and Goku, don't get me wrong, still very excited for Tech Hit coming back for the first time, and uh, I will be doing summons, so stay tuned for that guys, and hopefully part two when we get closer to Christmas will bring us even more stuff to get hyped for, but that's gonna do it for today's video. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about part one of Dokkan or of Global's Christmas celebration. And as always, if you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it, I'm out of here. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.